In this video, I'm going to provide the English translation of the report written by Dr. Linoli, who analyzed the Eucharistic miracle at Lanciano. Many people believe that this never happened. Where's the document? So here it is for you to share with as many people as you can. We're gonna start with the conclusions. The results of the research carried out on fragments of the ancient blood and of the ancient flesh, the tradition has led to us as the Eucharistic miracle of Lanciano, seventh century, are summarized in the following points. The blood of the Eucharistic miracle of Lanciano was truly such based on the demonstration of hemoglobin, alkaline hematin, within layer chromatography. The flesh was made up of striated muscle tissue, which due to the synctial union of the fibers proves to belong to the myocardium. For those that might not know, the myocardium is part of the heart. Flesh and blood belong to the human species as ascertained based on the zonal precipitation reaction of Ollenhoef. If you go on to read this document, that word will make sense. The blood group determined by the blood group determined by the absorption elution method was identical. A ble the blood group determined by the absorption elution method was identical. A B in the flesh and blood. Proteins have been demonstrated in the blood elution liquid, fractioned in the percentage ratios that occur in the serum protein framework of normal fresh blood. Chlorides, phosphorus, potassium, and sodium were found in the blood, while calcium was significantly increased. As I stated in my previous video, it was amazing how he stated that this appeared to be normal, fresh blood. How can 1,200-year-old blood appear to be fresh? It is a miracle. From here on out, I'm just going to have you read at your own speed, so I'll have the images, so just pause it and play. Again, this has never before been shown on YouTube in English, so I'm very blessed to have our friends Ashley and John that translated this. I'd appreciate if you follow them on social media. Um, they give tours in Rome. My wife and I actually went with them and it was amazing. They have such incredible wisdom and faith and are a wonderful witness to marriage. So hope you enjoy the rest of this and uh, feel free to share this with others. Doctors that are watching, if you have any comments, feel free to share those. Have a blessed day and God love you. I find it amazing that this is on PubMed. With that being stated, we would not consider this a peer-reviewed journal. I was able to obtain the instruction for authors sending manuscripts from the library in Siena, and there is not a trace of a faculty board or an expert board that selects among the papers to publish. So strictly speaking, it was not peer-reviewed, but nonetheless, it is a scientific journal with real medical articles, not a fake.